how many of you actually think about your roofs? Chances are most of us rarely do. They are very important when it's actually hot outside or raining heavily. We are well protected in our homes, right? These seasons have nothing to do with roofs for us. But there's a different world, there's a different situation. And in this situation, roofs matter. In this situation, when it's hot outside, people are not able to spend time inside their own house. When it's raining heavily, they prefer that everything's getting wet inside, right? Their clothes, their valuables, their belongings are all getting wet. And this situation makes their houses unlivable, right? This situation affects more than 300 million people in slums and villages in India alone, and more than a billion people worldwide. And this situation is caused by their roofs. The metal and cement roofing that they use causes this precise situation where a peaceful sleep is a luxury and we are solving that. So what are we doing about it, right? Our journey started uh, four years ago. We traveled across India. We spoke to more than uh, 600 families and we understood the housing situation in great detail. But we repeatedly saw hot roofs. The roofs were leaking all the time and the roofs were weak. In fact, we heard stories where there were accidental deaths because of unpredictable roofing. But the effects are far reaching. You know, it's not just about hot and leaky roofs. We spoke to families that were hesitant to expand their grocery shops or tailoring businesses. Why? Because there's water leakage inside the house. Why do it? We spoke to families that were avoiding social functions inside their own house because of poor roofing. So it was very clear to us that something has to be done about it, right? So, but there were more questions, right? What do we do? Sure, we can provide, we can think of strong roofs, insulating roofs, waterproof, beautiful, but what material will these new roofs be made of, right? Now, roofs are also not small. They don't fit in a pocket. How are we going to transport them all across India, all across the world, actually? And how, who's going to install them, right, reliably in remote parts of the country? So this became our journey. We did extensive materials research. In fact, more than 300 attempts at developing new materials. We were successful eventually. More than 200 attempts at new installation methods and waterproof connections and hundreds of investor pitches. What we thought would take six months, you know, to install a prototype and go to investors or customers, actually took two and a half years till our first roof was installed. But with outcomes like these, it was all worth it. We now have hundreds of these installed in slums and villages in several cities in India. Families love it. Of course, we provide the basics. The roofs are strong. They lower the temperature by 6 to 10 degrees inside. They're completely waterproof. But again, roofs are far-reaching consequences. People started to have dinner on top of the roof. They started to sleep on top of the roof. We know that 30% of our families started or expanded an economic activity because they have a reliable roof. The roofs stand out in the community. People are proud to own them. They pay for it. And we are committed to giving them after-sales service for the life of the product. There's also a special group of users that loves our product. They like to jump on top of our roof. It is these guys. This was important, actually. We had to go behind the science of an adult monkey jumping on top of the roof and the impact force they exert. And we did all that, a lot of science, a lot of fun, uh, but necessary to do. We had to do this. But this is all great, right? But real impact comes with scale. And when we scale, 
then environmental impact is important. We were watchful of this right from beginning. Our roofing is made from recycled materials like waste cardboard and waste plastic. The proprietary in-house self-developed materials in our lab. What is also important is affordability. 50% of our customers, to our surprise, they pay cash. In remaining, they prefer monthly installments and we avail them, sometimes as low as 750 rupees a month, and they can get high quality, reliable roofing. But as an engineer, my personal favorite is, give us any shape, any size, and we can pack the entire roof in a box, ship it anywhere in the world, and it can be installed and maintained by locals. This is all important if we want to have true impact, not just locally, this is not my hobby project, this is how I spend all my day, all my nights. So this is really important. This became the mission of our life as we dwell deeper and deeper into it. We saw houses like these, which are being transformed to beautiful houses, where we now put like carvings and LED lights and all that. And eventually the mission is to transform entire communities that look like this currently to what they could be and what they should be. This is what our mission is. This is what we work day and night. But things go deeper, right? Why did I even start this? There are real problems. I mean, we are sitting right here in uh, Dharavi, right? It's a, what I like to call a problem-rich environment. There are a lot of problems. You think about education, healthcare, financial inclusion, shelter, that need to be solved. What you guys can go back with today, share all the innovations with your team members, with your families and friends and helpers, spread the word. If you want to go beyond, then take up a problem and make it a mission of your life. And spend the rest of your life on it, because that is what is needed to bring real change. Now, as far as we are concerned, we work every single day so that kids, the younger generation, that is our focus. They can fly kites on top of the roof and they can take in the world from the roof. That's our mission. Thank you. Thank you.